Hi, uh, today we will cover uh, service layer uh, design pattern. The service layer design pattern uh, belongs to domain logic patterns and uh, this domain logic patterns belongs to patterns of enterprise application architecture. Uh, first we will see the explanation of uh, service layer uh, design pattern. This is the explanation. Service layer uh, defines an application boundary with a layer of services that establishes a set of available operations and coordinates the application response in each operation. Uh, we will see uh, one diagram and uh, some example so that you will understand this one uh, very easily and uh, here uh, you can see a uh, data source layer and uh, domain model and service layer so this is one application so this is the boundary this uh, service layer define the boundary of the application and this service layer contains uh, a layer of uh, services so it will have some uh, different kind of services and uh, it will have some uh, functionality so suppose uh, user wants to communicate to this uh, application so user has to call uh, the service layer uh, service layer and that service layer will contain set of services so user has to communicate to the uh, services and uh, that services internet it will call some business uh, logic and it will call some uh, database and it will do some calculation and return result to the service layer and service layer is responsible for giving result back to the uh, caller so service layer is the boundary it will have some uh, set of uh, services each services has uh, some functionality or operation client will communicate to that services uh, in order to communicate to the application so service layer is an entry point uh, we will see one example suppose say a uh, service layer and it has uh, calculate uh, monthly salary one functionality is there and uh, calculate leave some functionality is there suppose uh, this is in one uh, web application suppose uh, clients wants to communicate to that uh, application uh, it has to call this service layer and a service layer and the service layer contains this method so client has to communicate uh, to method this method of that service layer so that method what it will do is it will in turn call some uh, business classes and uh, that business classes will call uh, some database uh, queries and uh, then uh, that business class will calculate uh, what is a monthly salary for the particular person and it will return uh, uh, that result back to the service layer the business logic will return result back to the service layer then service layer will return a result back to the client so this is how it will work so this service layer act as a uh, application bound it's a, like an entry point okay and uh, so here it is defined in uh, one more uh, way so here uh, you can see presentation layer so presentation layer uh, is the interface to the user so then uh, user will make uh, some call to the business layer the business layer consists of uh, service layer and uh, data access layer and uh, this service layer uh, it provide service to the uh, presentation layer so suppose uh, user wants to communicate this presentation layer wants to communicate to the service layer and this service layer provides some services so the uh, presentation layer has to use that services and uh, this service layer uh, control the application flow and uh, it modifies the domain object and it will take uh, some value from the domain object and it will do the business uh, process and uh, this uh, data access layer uh, so this is responsible for communicating to the database uh, to get some value from the uh, database table and uh, do some calculations so this layer is responsible for communicating to the database and uh, this business layer uh, it handles the domain objects and uh, modify them the business layer contains service layer and data access layer and this data layer it consists of uh, db uh, that this layer will load or store data from the uh, it will load data from the database or store data to the database so this layer is responsible for that and here the important thing is this service layer so it provides service to the presentation uh, layer and uh, 
how we can use uh, domain facet or service facet with service layer uh, that we can see uh, in this uh, picture so suppose internal client is there the internal client will directly make call to the service layer suppose external client is there then in between service layer and external client we can define uh, uh, domain facet or uh, service facet and the external client will make call to the domain facet or service uh, facet then service facet will call to the uh, service layer so in this way we can uh, use service layer along with the uh, facet so i have created separate uh, video for facet design pattern you can log in and watch it in my uh, channel okay and uh, this is about uh, service layer uh, design pattern and uh, thanks for watching bye